Okay, here we go. It's Friday. James P. Madonna, Facebook group, everything is food. And, uh, let's see, uh, what luck I have with the duck. I have a feeling that my luck is running thin. Oh, maybe not. All right, the lady was kind enough uh, not to uh, take it all. Succulent raw stuff. Whatever pieces, whatever pieces uh, are left, so they bring more. Right? Yeah. Eh, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? We got. I just got here, by the way. They're the Royal Hibachi Grill and, and Buffet. Uh, here we got the shrimp with Creole, but I'm going to leave that for later. Uh, let me check and see if we got any... Uh, whoa. Mm, they're ribs. I don't know what kind of... I wonder if these are the lamb ribs. Whatever they, it is, they look great. They look wonderful. I hope they're the lamb ribs like last week. I mean, the weeks before. Costilla, they say it's Look at that. Look at that. Beautiful. I don't know. One time they had lamb. I wonder if this is a lamb. Let me see on the other side. Uh, no, it don't say. It don't say. It don't say, but eh, chicken I can have at home anytime. Spinach? Yeah, maybe I'll have the spinach on the way back. What do we got? Roast turkey. Oh, roast turkey. Uh, shrimp, uh, fettuccine alfredo with shrimp. Uh, maybe he knows. Hey, sir, is this lamb rib or it is lamb rib? Barbecue? Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. It is lamb rib. Yeah, it's lamb. Okay, good. Let's see what we got going here. Royal Hibachi, uh, the grill, Route 46 West, Saddlebrook, New Jersey. Um, what's that? All oh, these onion rings. Okay. Uh, well, I'll wait till they bring up the fried calamari. Mm -hmm. Uh, we've got cauliflower, grilled cauliflower, my favorite vegetable, but I have no room. <laughs> Let me see what we got. Uh, they're going to have the Arabic rice today or no? Yeah, 3 o'clock, sir. 3, 3 p.m.? Oh, good. Yeah, Delicious. You got it. Shout out to uh, my Nia dear Natalia Rodriguez of uh, San Diego, California, and the creator himself, Mario Petrus. And uh, in the case of fresh mozzarella with tomato, they shout out to Salvatore Mercurio. But I don't have any room. I have a, a total paleo ketogenic plate. No room for any veggies. But maybe, eh, maybe I could get some. Maybe I could put some of this cauliflower on here. Yeah, how come my grandmother used to say Kali, cauliflower? I don't know why she pronounced everything very strangely. All right, hold on. Oh, oh we got some, some squash. Looks like zucchini. Sauteed uh, zucchini with uh, onions and tomatoes. Maybe get some of this. Very good. All right. Best I can do. But right. I'm sorry, I gotta go for the good stuff first because people will grab it. Hey, we're gonna got chocolate covered strawberries for you romantic uh, couples that are coming to the buffet today. How about that? Chocolate covered strawberries. What a, what a pleasant surprise. Chocolate covered strawberries. And then we have uh, the usual. Over there we have uh, 
against the bak bak former baklava over there. All right, I'm going to my seat now. It is fr Friday afternoon for my usual lunch excursion, Jane's Pre Madonna, Megalite 21, Facebook group, everything is food. A shout out also to Mr. Anthony Laura. And of course, Mick Von Raven. All right. Oh, that's right, I forgot the lemons from my water. What the hell's wrong with me? Oofa, what's wrong with me? What is wrong with me? Okay, here we go. I'm not gonna bore you with my trip to get lemons. Okay, here we have succulent barbecue lamb ribs. Pleasant surprise, because they just brought it up. And underneath the grilled cauliflower, we have roast duck. So it's it's going to be an Atkins plate uh, to start off this Friday afternoon. And uh, it's Royal Hibachi Grill and Buffet, Route 46 West, Saddlebrook, New Jersey. Facebook group. Everything is food. Creator, Mario Petrus. Um, and um, administrator, and uh, we have a, um, we have some very outstanding um, moderators. All right, all right. It's going to be an Atkins plate to start off. I'm sorry, but I had to do it this way because if I don't dive in to the uh, creme de la creme, somebody else will do it. So being that I just got here, this is what I have to do. Okay, the lamb ribs are very succulent. So is the duck. It's a very succulent first dish. All right, it's James P. Madonna, round two. Let's see if, uh, let's see if fried calamari made its appearance. Onion rings. I don't know. It looks like more onion rings. Uh, not yet. Oh man. Uh, let me get my usual. Let me get my usual roll grape leaves. Oh. Royal Hibachi Grill or Buffet, Route 46 West, Saddlebrook, New Jersey. Um, Facebook group, everything is food. Uh, eh, that's enough. I really got wiped out by all those lamb ribs. My God, I think I broke a record, honestly, for the most <clears throat> napkins used because of the barbecue sauce. But they were great, though. See what else I'm gonna have here for round two. No fried calamari, not yet. All right, in honor of Sal Mercurio, I'm gonna get some fresh mozzarella with tomato slice. I gotta, I gotta like, I gotta rest my stomach after all that meat, roast duck. And uh, lamb, lamb ribs, barbecue lamb ribs. I need a rest. I need a break. Uh, oh, looks interesting. What is it? Minced cucumbers and uh, tomatoes. I always love cucumbers. Now, the seafood salad is a tad bit too many bell peppers in there. There used to be more more seafood. Um, I, I kind of feel bad for octopus, you know, otherwise known as Popo, right? Very intelligent animal of the sea. I really feel bad that they're harvested, you know. Um, I don't know. Uh, maybe I'll get... Oh, go, go ahead. Go ahead. No, it's okay. I guess they're cucumbers. I hope they are. Um, 
Well, you know what? I know these are cucumbers. Be a good break. Uh, that's it for now until the seafood come more seafood comes out. Um, it's probably tilapia. I don't do tilapia. Wow, look at the size of these mushrooms. With um, I'm not sure what that is because there's no sign out yet, yeah, but I'll definitely come back. This looks like a type of chicken teriyaki. This is the um, the rolled uh, flounder with uh, shrimp in the middle. I think I'll grab one of those because I know they're good. Broiled uh, flounder fillet with the, with the shrimp in the center. All right. Okay. That should do it. That should be a pleasant break for my stomach. Uh. Take a look at this sushi bar real quick. Oh, they're wiped out, man. Look at that. Sushi bar is wiped out. That, I believe, is squid sashimi. Calamari sashimi, I think. I could be wrong. Either squid or flounder. I think, I think it's calamari. The body cut open, flat. You know? And then over here we have what knocked me on my ass, lamb ribs, right? um, Mongolian barbecue, and that's it. Let me go back to the seat. Oh, they took away the turkey. Oh, I missed the turkey. I missed the roast turkey, which was a pleasant surprise. Oh, look, look what happened. Somebody messed up the... Uh, Chocolate covered uh, strawberries here. How did that happen? Probably some kid did it, you know? Some kid that, that deserves for Krampus to visit him. Chocolate covered strawberries again. We desperately need Krampus nowadays with the way children are. I'm telling you, I guarantee, I guarantee fresh pineapple is always good for the digestion. All right. Okay. Let me give myself a little break here. Oh, more people are coming in. Very busy place. Very busy place. Okay, here we go. Roll grape leaves. Fresh mozzarella, tomato. Cucumber salad. And a flounder filet broiled. Wrapped around a jumbo shrimp. Phase two. All right, phase three. Let me see what's what's out here. Looking for the uh, Arabic rice. Any Arabic rice coming up? No, no I don't see it yet. Yeah. Well, I'll get some squid sashimi because I believe that's what it is. All right, get a few of these. Squid. There we go. Calamari sashimi. Keep myself busy here. Mm -hmm. Some seaweed salad. Uh, 
wakame, sesame flavor wakame, see if see we salad. Jane's Prima Donna, Facebook group, everything is food. Alright. Oh, well, that's about it. They, uh, they must be behind. Maybe they're too short on, on staff here this week at the sushi bar. Um, get some soy sauce. Oh boy. I'm still waiting on that Arabic salad. I mean Arabic rice, rather. I don't see it yet. Nope. No Arabic rice yet. Let me ask this guy. Excuse me, Senor. Do they have uh, Arabic rice coming? Arabic rice? Uh, Arabic rice? Yeah, Arabic rice. Uh, Oh, tell the tell the head cook the you know the flounder that's wrapped around the cameroon is raw. Yeah, the the flounder is raw. Of course, I got to zero in on the chocolate covered strawberries again, right? Okay, just wrapping around here. Apple crumb pie. I don't know. This is like a baklava. This chocolate cake is very good. Who knows, maybe they'll come out with tray leche again. Another type of chocolate cake. This is similar, I guess, to a German chocolate cake. Fluorescent strawberry? I don't know, what would you call it? All right, I'm still waiting on the Arabic rice. All right, so this is what I have. That's all I could find out there. Um, it's calamari sashimi with a sesame flavored wakame seaweed salad. And I just placed the, uh, the uh, wasabi in the soy sauce, which I'm stirring up now. Okay, and that's it. Uh, I'm waiting on the Arabic rice. All right, this is my last phase. Um, as you can see, the theme of this week, this Friday, is uh, barbecue lamb ribs, very succulent as you can see. Here we have some whiting, whiting fish, but I'm not in the mood for whiting, to be honest with you. But I tell you what they do have, they, they did just put out that I'm in the mood for, fried calamari. And I do see possibly tentacles in there. How about that? Yes, I do. For the first time, I see some tentacles. There you go. Okay. These are in fried calamari in honor of uh, Mr. Salvatore Mercurio, the emperor of all moots, the king of all moots, even though the moots is often disrespected. That should be enough. Yeah, I don't want to be a hog, you know. All right. At least it's out, you know, that's the main thing. With some of this uh, great mar marinara sauce and stuff. There we go. Calamari marinara. 
No Arabic rice. Uh, what are you gonna do? Eh. Maybe next time. Hey, Salvatore Mercurio, fresh mozzarella. Look at that, new tray. But I already have my fill. How about that? No, no, no tray leche. All right, that's about it. I'm not even gonna go for the sushi. I got my work cut out for me here with the uh, fried calamari. Here you go, the shrimp with the heads on them. Shrimp with the heads on them. Snow crab clusters over there. Too much, too much work for me, you know? So, camarones. Italian camarones with the heads. Sushi still wiped out. What a shame, what a shame, what a shame. Okay, that's it. Okay. This is it. This is the tail end of my lunch buffet here this Friday afternoon. Royal Hibachi Grill Buffet. Route 46 West, Saddlebrook, New Jersey, right by the Walmart, 24 hour fitness. This is it. Tender succulent fried calamari with marinara sauce on it. Next is dessert, which most likely is going to be ice cream, ice cream, and uh, a little bit of fresh pineapple for my digestion. My dig as a digestive. Shout out to Mr. J. Tirio, Andui Louie of, of uh, Southern Louisiana, Mr. Mardi Gras himself. J. Tirio. Uh, check him. Check his um, Facebook group called Alcohol Legs. That's right, you heard it. Alcohol Legs, and also he, he is seen on the web with his many uh, educational shows on fine hard liquor, sometimes wine. J. Tirio. But mostly go to the Facebook group, Alcohol Olates. All right. My dessert plans have changed a little bit because I see Tres Leche again for the second week in a row, Tres Leche. Uh, greetings, Natalia Rodriguez. This Tres Leche is in honor of Natalia Rodriguez. And uh, there you go, succulent tray leche. You get a little leche for the tray leche. Don't mind me, I'm not talking to myself, I'm, I'm on the video. I don't want people to think I'm talking to myself. Everybody's looking at me. <laughs> I'll be out of your way, don't worry. I'm gonna get some of this, some of this leche for the tray leche. There we go. Isn't that beautiful? All right, I'm gone. Yeah, that's about it. There we go. Beautiful tray leche, succulent tray leche. Loaded with uh, with leche, actually. Here, you want me? Should I get ice cream? I got ice cream at home. You know what? I'm gonna work on this. Maybe one piece of pineapple. One piece of fresh pineapple should, should do it. All right. This is it. This is the grand finale. Tray, succulent tray leche with a piece of fresh pineapple for digestion. All right? I'm done. I'm, I'm stuck. Jay Spring Madonna signing off. Facebook group, everything is food. <laughs>